All month long, we've been celebrating Hispanic Heritage Month, and tonight, a mariachi group right here in our area is back to performing together after a hiatus during the pandemic. Mariachi Los Amigos was formed more than four decades ago. They've played thousands of gigs over the years, from small get-togethers to performing for presidents. News 4's Mauricio Casillas shows us how the group is leaving its mark with the Latino community. Pride and passion emanates from Daniel Sheehy's basement. The plucking of strings, the blaring of the trumpet, the vibration of the violin, and of course, the booming voice bringing it all together. 44 years from their first gig, Mariachi Los Amigos are still going strong in 2022. We started playing uh, for the all-you-can-eat Mexican dinner at the Ramada Inn, now defunct Ramada Inn in Alexandria. Sheehy's from California and was part of the first collegiate mariachi group in UCLA. When he moved to the DMV, he wanted to keep playing the music he loved. It was much different in 1978. The Mexican community was much smaller, Latino community was much smaller. And, uh, you know, people were looking for ways to kind of come together around something. And mariachi music is powerful for the force of bringing people together. The music created a sense of community, but the group was also serious about its craft. Rehearsals were a must, and an attention to detail and quality is what set them apart. We were kind of putting a marker down and maybe sh helping shine a light on a, on a broader community that for decades really wasn't recognized much at all in the greater Washington area. And the group has helped immigrants like Mario Castro feel at home. I'm proud to be Mexican because this, this uh, Mexican music is, is beautiful. I, I love it. And no gig is too small or too big for them. They've had the chance to play in the White House for multiple presidents and dignitaries. I never thought you know, I want to be in the White, White House. Never. Bill Clinton says, OK, play something for us, boys. <laughs> and our Vuela player was so caught off guard, he, he dropped his pick. And we were, <laughs> whoa, what's this? And uh, we went home with still kind of our, our jaws dropping, you know, because of the, of the honor and the surprise of that. Like with everything, there's been highs and lows. The togetherness that comes with mariachi music was stripped away from the group when COVID hit. For some members, playing gigs was their main source of income. During that time, it was, was tough uh, for, for all musicians. Uh, it was no jobs, nothing at all. For me, playing music is a social gathering, and so it's something that I need. Now that the pandemic has eased, the demand for mariachi music is booming. The group is thriving. And if you ask them when they'll stop... I love this music and I'm, I play until, I don't know, but forever. My, my main thing is playing music, and so I, I love doing this, communicating through my music. Mariachi Los Amigos, the friends who these days feel a lot more like familia, family. Mauricio Casillas. News 4.